Hey Genesis, I just wanted to reach out to you here. I uh, I wanted to share with you a couple of things that are coming up. We've having to make some hard decisions, and uh, so I wanted you to be the first to know. Uh, we just made the decision in the last 30, 45 minutes that we need to cancel youth camp for our kids. Now we hate doing that. There's no fun in that, but uh, it doesn't do us any good to have the kids practice social distancing while they're at camp before camp and then we can't social distance them on our way down in that transportation. Second of all, we can't guarantee what the social distance looks like at camp this year. And so the last thing we'd wanna do is send a healthy student back, or send a healthy student down and have them come back ill. So we've made the hard decision to say, no, we're not gonna go to camp. It's not popular, it's not fun, it's not one of the things that we enjoy doing, but we really look at this for the best outcome long-term for the students and the student ministry. And so as much as we hate to cancel, we feel like that's the right decision. And so that's the one that we're gonna hold to. I talked to Wadi, talked to the youth team, and uh, we feel like this is overall the best and I am confident it's the best decision. So it's my decision, don't be mad at them. I just feel like this is the right decision for our youth ministry and for our church at this time. Second of all, we're gonna be online this weekend and the next weekend. It's possible, it's possible that we could be online for the entire month of July. We'll let you know. But uh, we still have uh, some outreaches coming up on the 18th. We've got a blood drive and we're doing a produce giveaway on that Saturday. So we want you to join us, mask up, glove up, but come out and help us spread the love of Jesus Christ. The last thing I wanna tell you is this. Uh, we're trying to just make contact with people. We care about you. We wanna know how things are going. And if we don't get a chance to reach out to you, would you please reach out to us by a call, a text, an email uh, to one of the pastors, one of our team. Let us know if there's a need, if there's something. Listen, we've got some extra cash in our compassion fund. If you're struggling with grocery money, you need help with a car payment, you're struggling as it relates to utility bill, don't, don't struggle in that. Just allow us to come alongside. We care about you, we love you, and we wanna minister to you. And so uh, we are praying for you. During this time, please pray for us. Your tithes and offerings are making a huge difference. Right now, not only are we giving to missions, but we're also helping some other churches that are having a shortfall. And so we're walking down this line of faith to where we're believing God to supply for us as we're helping supply for others. Ephesians 6 and 8, whatsoever good thing you do for someone else, the same thing the Lord will do for you. So we're asking for your continued faithfulness and giving and support. And please, please, we don't want to go through a summer slump. We don't want to go through a COVID slump. We want to stay strong so that we can minister, we can love people and share the gospel of Jesus. So help us. We want to say thank you for your giving. Listen, man, we love you. Jennifer and I love you. I'm going to ask that you pray for her. She's had some complications from her knee surgery. And we're just asking for additional prayer. She's in a lot of pain. And the last thing we want is another knee surgery. So we're just asking for your prayer for Jennifer. Listen, man, we love you. We're praying for you. Our team loves you. And we look forward to catching up with you later. All right, have a happy, safe 4th of July. And we'll see you next time. See you soon. All right, we love you.